Hi guys, welcome back to High Yield Interday Trading. I hope everyone of you is doing good. So this would be a short video on how HYIT is performing with respect to the equity cash premium recommendations. But before that, let me request you all to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also make sure to press the bell icon so that whenever I upload a video, you get the notification about the same. Okay, also by the end of this video, you will be seeing many other details about HYIT. Please do have a look as it might be helpful to you in some way or the other details like my telegram channel both the free one and the premium ones details about my training programs etc etc okay so back to our performance now this month that is for the month of november 2019 the total number of calls given were 40 four, zero. profit making calls were 28 and loss making calls were 12 okay so we stand exactly at 70 percent accuracy or strike rate whatever you would want to call it and also one thing that i would like to mention is i have not considered two calls because those were some extra calls that were provided and both of them hit the stop loss okay but since they were extra calls i am not considering them in the count okay even if those calls would have been in profits i would have not included them in the count Okay, so uh, it's important for me to tell about these things because uh, things should be transparent and that's what I'm doing here. Okay, so let me take you all to the Telegram channel where the real action happens so that you all can see it for yourself. Okay, so let me bring on Telegram here. So this is the Telegram channel. On the left hand side, everything is squeezed because it contains the identity of the people who contact me, and I don't want to, uh, I don't want everybody to have a look on them. So it has been squeezed. The left hand side pane. Okay, this is HYT Equity Cash Premium, where we provide, or I would say I provide uh, the equity cash recommendations. Okay, so right now what you see on the screen is 29th of November, uh, which was yesterday. Okay, let's, let's get up to the uh, let's get on to the starting of the month. Okay. Don't remember the date. Let's get on first. Uh, yeah. October 31st. Yeah. Uh, November 4, uh, 4th. Yeah. November 4th was the first day of uh, November when I started giving the recommendations. So I will go ahead and scroll down slowly so that you can have a look yourself. Okay. What all has happened. So this is the summary. One call given. It was in profit. Similarly, the rest continues. Okay. So there's no point in explaining stuffs because they are just calls and uh, it just shows that whether we were in profits or we were in losses. Okay. So this is for November 7th. Okay. I'm just scrolling down slowly so that you all can have a look. You can pause the video and keep looking into it. That's fine. That is why I'm scrolling slowly. Please do excuse me for that. Okay. The whole purpose, as I said, is to be transparent. Yeah, so this was the day. Which was the day? November 18th was the day when uh, I was talking about two calls which were not being considered, right? So on this day, total four number of calls were given and all the four calls were in loss. Actually, many people went mad on me <laughs> on that day as well. Uh, but that's normal. I mean, uh, that is normal. If somebody is in a loss, uh, he will go mad. But what they should also consider is these four calls on which we made losses if we compare that to the other calls which were given throughout the month uh, these calls will be will not carry any importance right because overall we are in good profits in comparison to the losses that we have made and that is what matters okay our profits should be much more than the losses which we make okay so that's okay I made them understand and uh, the good thing is they understood. Okay, it was just in the heat of the moment that uh, they told something or the other. That's okay. I understand. Okay, so I'm still scrolling here. Okay, this is for 28th of November. This is 21st of November. 22nd of November. 25th of November. This is the summary for 26th. This is the summary for 27th. This is the summary for 28th November. This is the summary. And for 29th November, this is the summary. Okay. So 
this is what happened for the entire month of November, guys. Uh, as I said, if you want to have uh, a check, if you want to have some more time, then you can uh, for sure pause the video and uh, have a look on the information that I have just shown on Telegram. Okay. So, uh, as I said earlier, we stand at 70% uh, of uh, strike rate. Uh, and 70% strike rate is something that is good enough. I would not say good, rather I would say it's a profitable. It's it's profitable enough for anyone to earn money on a monthly basis. Okay, and that too in intraday trading, this number is actually huge. Okay, because intraday trading is a totally different species. It is a totally different ball game. Okay, which most of the people do not get a grasp of. Okay, so that's it, guys. Just wanted to share HYIT's performance for this month. Last month, the strike rate was 83.33 percent and we will surely try to be on the higher numbers in the coming months okay and need, needless to say you can always get in touch with me if you want to join in the premium recommendations or if you want to take up the training programs and stuff like that okay the details of all these things are there in the description section you can have a look and then take the action accordingly okay so that's it guys and as always i would request you all to like and subscribe to my youtube channel and also please do not miss the ending of this video as you will get to know about the other details about HYIT that might be helpful to you and also please do not forget to like the video if you liked it okay so that's all from my end and i will see you all later hope you all will stick back happy trading bye bye